Ok Nhà này mai thơ sĩ Sẵn chú trầy Sẵn chú trầy Ok Mẹ thả sẵn chú trầy Đọc nệm mơ khơi Đã sẵn chú Sẵn ôi mẹ Ok Mẹ thả sẵn chú trầy Mẹ khăn thọt bí khe Mẹ ôi nệm mơ Đã chú mơ ôi Vậy Ok So uh, we're gonna go through over the ingredients. Um, haven't done this in two months, so let's uh, get started. All right, so right, right here we have a uh, basil, and uh, we have rice patty herb. We have uh, saw tooth or saw leaf herb. We have uh, green onion, uh, galanga. We have uh, kaffir lime leaf, lemongrass, and that's what we have in terms of the greens. We have garlic, we have catfish uh, that we cleaned and that we sliced into pieces, we have shrimp peeled and divined, uh, this is a tamarind, uh, it's a, you get it in this package right here, um, and my mom used a, uh, this package is like real packed. Um, my mom used about a two inch by one inch by one inch um, piece and she mixed it with hot water and this is how much she got. So we're gonna put that into the soup. Uh, I need to my scoy. I need in the middle. Okay, so we have uh, sugar, salt, we have uh, fried garlic, uh, we have pineapple, we have tomato, and we have fuzzy melon. We also have granulated chicken flavor soup base mix. And we also have fish sauce. And if we forgot anything throughout the video, we'll tell you. So, alright guys, so we'll, let's uh, get to it. Okay. Alright guys, so um, we have a pot of 8 cups of water. You can add more water or less water depending on how you like uh, this type of soup. Uh, so we're going to go ahead and add in uh, some of the ingredients. We got... Um, Two, four, six pieces of kaffir lime leaf. We got uh, one stalk of the lemongrass. We have a little piece of galanga. And we have about five to six pieces of garlic crushed. And we also, if you can look at the, the lemongrass, we also crushed that also. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and let that boil. And on the side, we're gonna go ahead and add some oil uh, to a pan. And we're gonna go ahead and uh, fry the, like, kind of like pan fry the, uh, the catfish. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and pan fry that, uh, make it a little bit crispy, or just a little, you know, brown it from the outside. Uh, you don't wanna, I don't think you wanna cook it dirty. I put it on. Put it on, eh? Oh, so you're gonna cook it on the pan fry? Oh, okay. Okay. I can't explain that in, in English. Uh, pretty much, uh, I think what she said is uh, you want to cook it until all the blood comes out, which there really isn't a lot of blood, um, just juices, really. So, yeah, pretty much we're just going to go ahead and cook up the outside. We're not really going to cook it thoroughly. Alright, All right, so it's been about a minute since this is boiling, so we're going to go ahead and add about one tablespoon of salt. And a little bit more, so about a tablespoon and a half of salt. And back to the fish. Bye. Alright, so we're going to go ahead and let that uh, cook up about halfway, uh, not okay. thoroughly, okay? So, alright, so we're going to go ahead and take it out. And now we're going to go ahead and add the fish into the water. Alright. 
quay cái All right, guys. So now we're gonna go ahead and add in the pineapple. Soon after uh, we added in the fish, and now we're gonna go ahead, go ahead and add in the fuzzy melon. Uh, add as many vegetables as you want. We use about half a pineapple here. Uh, we use okay. one fuzzy. All right, melon. guys. So it's a, it's been about uh, ten minutes, and we're gonna go ahead and add in the shrimp. My dad told them. Okay. And we're gonna go ahead and add in the tomato. Bad. Now we're not gonna use MSG, that's why we had the granulated uh, chicken soup base mix. So we're gonna use about, let's see, we got one tablespoon. Bad. Okay, so we have about one and a half uh, tablespoons. Alright, so we're gonna go ahead and uh, mix it all up. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and let that boil and we'll get back to you. Alright, guys, so uh, the water uh, or the soup came to a boil and we're gonna go ahead and add in the tamarind uh, water that we. I uh, had from earlier from this little from this little cup that we had. Remember, it was like about two inches by one inch by one inch, and we added hot water. That's the that's the aftermath. That's what we that's got it. from it. And we're gonna go ahead and add in uh, that liquid. And this is what makes the soup uh, sour. Now, if you can't get a hold of this, you can use a tamarind soup. Uh, tamarind soup mm -hmm. base, and we're gonna use about about okay, two okay. tablespoons to three tablespoons of fish sauce. Alright, mm -hmm. <laughs> But uh, this is the fried garlic from earlier, and we have about uh, one big scoop, about one tablespoon of that we're gonna add into. Alright, but we're going to go ahead and add all of that into the pot. Okay, so before we uh, put it in a bowl, I'm going to go ahead and uh, take a little taste test uh, in the pot with a spoon, see if I. Uh, See if it's sour enough for me. If it's not, then I'm gonna go ahead and uh, we're gonna add in some uh, tamarind uh, soup base because I like mine. Alright, guys. So sour. I'm going to uh, take a little taste test of the soup. Uh, well, the soup I like it really sour. Uh, my mom tends to make it not as sour as I like to because she says that the balance in the soup is supposed to be the way it is. It's kind of sour, but it's also sweet. Has it? It's it's the balance is good. But I just like mine's really sour, so I'm gonna go ahead and take a little taste test. It's good, but I like mine's more sour. And uh, what we're gonna do is we're gonna add in the. Uh, what you can do is if that's not sour enough for you and you want it more sour, you can use a tamarind uh, soup base, and uh, just add it in there. Uh, small amounts at a time until you get it to uh, the consistency consistency that you like so that's what we're gonna do um, until I find the perfect All spot. Right guys, so the soup is done I added in some more uh, tamarind uh, soup base um, make it more sour because I like it more sour uh, add as much as you like but this is real sour now so we're gonna go ahead and uh, we're gonna go ahead and give it a taste test. So, first with the soup. That's good. Oh, that's real good. Do it. Do my thing. Alright, so, you know, you, gotta, you always gotta do this. You gotta get a little bit of rice, get a little bit of soup. That's good. 
Nhà mỏ, chan thơm nó tốt Yeah, <laughs> yeah piece of shrimp Everything about the soup is great. I'm gonna try the catfish yet. That's good. Mmm. Alright. So I'm gonna go ahead and enjoy uh, the rest of my meal. And um, you guys go ahead and make some. And I hope you guys enjoy too, because uh, this this tastes real good. I mean, this is uh, everything in here is fresh. You got fresh pineapple, fresh tomato, all the greens, the fish, the fish, the catfish. We actually caught on Monday. Uh, we went fishing, me and my bro. And uh, so I mean, it's straight out of the lake, not at the store, out of the lake. Uh, the shrimp we got at the store, so. My throat's really late. My throat's really late. Alright. So, uh, yeah. Uh, I hope you guys uh, give this a try because this is, uh, this is real good. I mean, this is my mom's recipe. And you know, my mom's recipe always comes straight from the heart. Comes straight from Cambodia. There is no, you know, there is no modifying it. The way she learned it is the way she made it. So I hope you guys give it a try. And uh, yeah, enjoy it, man. Sorry yeah, about, uh, take care, you man. know, lagging it on videos and the recipes. But uh, we're going to get right back on track. Uh, so, you know, stay updated. You know, stay, stay subscribed. And we will have more videos, more recipes. Uh, I got a lot of uh, requests for a lot of different things. Uh, some things to expect. Uh, on our next video would be Mom the Home. So wait for that. Alright guys? Take it easy. Bye.